Way back in late April, Black Metal Gamer suggested Cavity Busters. He said it's quite similar to The Binding of Isaac, a game that I really enjoy the hell out of. So I figured I would do a review now, many months later. So here we are with Cavity Busters. Now looking at screenshots of the game, it definitely gives off a Binding of Isaac vibe to it, which games like that I just get really interested in. Cavity Busters was developed and published by Space My Friend and released on PC in August of 2020. You play as Gummy the Soft, who has fallen from the Great Gob, you will chomp your way through enemies and face off against the Pearly Knights, which is a true test. You will collect upgrades and diseases to enhance your agility and make you stronger and tougher. There are over 150 upgrades. Now granted, some will help you and some will fuck you up. Now there is some differences compared to a similar game like The Binding of Isaac. You can wall run, jump, and so on. But that is all on how you control Gummy. Not only that, jumping will give you a better view of the area you are at and you can jump on enemies. You can roll, dodge, and all that fun shit too. One thing I will say about Cavalry busters this game is fucking tough the difficulty is ramped up way more than what i've seen in other games hell even the binding of isaac is not this difficult now granted there is options to make the game more forgiving sometimes i do okay sometimes i'm dead within a minute and really that is my own fuck ups enemies will attack you in a few different ways and one of them it's bullet hell like now granted if you wall run the bullets will turn blue and you can go through them but man this game just really packs a punch so you're gonna see me die a lot in this review and i just really struggled but you know what i can't I hate the game for that. I like a good challenge. I think it's fun. The graphics for Cavity Busters are really fucking awesome. Nice graphic style, very colorful, very well done designs at the levels too, which every time you die, you get a new map layout similar to the Binding of Isaac. The enemies look great, so do the bosses. Gummy the Soft looks funny as hell. The game has some crude humor to it, but not entirely like the Binding of Isaac. I mean, there's mention of farts, poop, and so on. There isn't anything like menstrual blood, tampons, and so on. At least I have never came across it. But the graphics are just fucking killer in this game. Nothing to complain about here. The music, I really enjoy it. Kind of spooky, kind of doomy, but has that upbeat style to it, very well composed. The sound effects from attacking the enemies and of course them attacking you and so on is great stuff. I enjoy it a lot, fits the game very well. The controls, I am using the WSAD keys to move around, space to jump, right mouse to wall run and roll, space to use a shotgun like weapon, left mouse button to attack. If you hold the left mouse button, you can do a charge attack. For the most part, I don't mind the controls at all. Some might struggle because it does take a little bit to get used to, but I think they're very responsive and handle great. Cavity Busters is a good game. Tough as hell, not forgiving, especially with the bullet hell aspect thrown in there. The gameplay is just a blast. The graphics are very well done. The music is enjoyable as well as the sound effects, the controls. While it took me a little bit to get used to, I think they respond well and are easy to understand. Granted, you can play this game with a controller as well, but I felt it was more comfortable using the keyboard and mouse here. Some might say the difficulty is a flaw because it's too tough for them, but I'm not going to use that. I think this is a fucking really well done roguelike game, and I definitely see inspirations from other roguelikes, especially the Binding of Isaac here. Now, if you want to pick up Cavity Busters, the game is $14.99 on Steam, so go pick it up. You can get the complete body bundle for around $20, which features both games from Space My Friend, as the developer has one other game titled Room, which is a bullet hell shooter, and that has to do with the body plagued by viruses and so on. At a later time, I might check that game out. Well, I hope you enjoyed this review of Cavity Busters. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to brush and floss your teeth.